in the last video, I showed that a bunch of triangles are similar to each other. To come up with a relationship between the focal length, the distance of an object from the convex lens, and the distance of the image of an object from that convex lens. And I realized that there was one extra low-hanging fruit based on all of the geometry that I had done, another relationship that might come in useful. And that's the relationship between the size of the object, or maybe we since it's an arrow here, we could call it the height of the object and the height of the image and the height of the image and we did we really set up everything already we already figured out that this triangle over here this triangle over here is similar to this triangle down here and we figured out in the last video that this triangle over here is similar to this triangle over here and since these two are similar we could say that a is to b we did this over here. I'll rewrite it. A is to B as A, and both of those are the, the sides opposite the right angles of these two similar triangles. So that's going to be the same thing as the ratio of the sides opposite this yellow angle, opposite this yellow angle right over here. So in this triangle over here, since we started with A first, it's this height right over here. Now what is this height right over here? This is the height of the object. This is the height of the object. So this is the height of the object is to, now what is this opposite side of this yellow angle right over here? Well, this is the height of the image. Height of the image. Or we know that the, from the last video, the distance of the object to the distance of the image is the same thing as a to b. So this is going to be the same thing as this. So the ratio of the distances is also the same thing as the, the ratio of their heights. So let me write it this way. So the ratio of the distance from the object to the lens to the distance of the from the image to the lens is the same as the ratio of the height of the object to the height of an image or to the image of that object. So I just wanted to do that little low hanging fruit there since we had already uh, done all of the all of the we've set up all of the mechanics already. Anyway, hopefully you found that useful.